Hello, welcome to episode 73 of the Flight Sim Historian. For this episode, we are going to be looking at the Boeing Vertol C-847 Chinook. The Chinook was an American twin-engine tandem rotor, heavy lift helicopter, developed by Vertol and by extension Boeing Rotorcraft Systems. It was first flown on the 21st of September of 1961 and entered service in 1962 with the United States military. Over 1,200 had been produced since 1962. They served during the Vietnam War, the Iran-Iraq War, the Falklands War, the Persian Gulf War, Operation Iraqi Freedom, and Operation Enduring Freedom, among others. Variants of the Chinook include the CH-47A, the ACH-47A gunship, the CH-47B, C, D, the MH-47D, the MH-47E, the CH-47F, the MH-47G, which is the example you see in this video, the CH-47J for Japan, and the HH-47. Military operators of the Chinook have included Australia, Canada, Taiwan, Egypt, Greece, India, Iran, Italy, Japan, South Korea, Saudi Arabia, Libya, Morocco, the Netherlands, Singapore, Spain, Thailand, Turkey, the United Arab Emirates, United Arab Emirates, the United Kingdom, the United States, Argentina, and Vietnam. Civil operators have included Taiwan's National Fire Agency, Columbia Helicopters, Billings Flying Service, Aero Helicopters, and Trump Airlines in the United States, and CHC Helicopter Service in Norway. The Chinook has a crew of three with seating for up to 55 troops or 24,000 pounds of cargo. It is powered by a pair of Lycoming T-55 turboshaft engines with power outputs of 4,730 horsepower each. The helicopter is capable of reaching a maximum speed of 196 miles per hour, a range of up to 1,200 miles, and a surface ceiling of 20,000 feet. So for this video, we are going to be using the MH-47 from Area 51 because it's the only Chinook that I could find that I could afford at the time that I bought it. All right, so let's take a look inside. It's a glass cockpit, which isn't my favorite thing, but, you know, it is what it is. And yeah, they never started that quick in real life.
that landing was a little hard.